Okay. I was drawing on the background layer that whole time. So that's <laughs> that's great that we just solved that. Uh, <laughs> I'm ready. I'm ready.
on the bottom left. Yeah, I think that's that's kind of what I have here. Um, yeah, and I think you're right. I, I like though that one's a bit more tall. I think the legs on the on the in the first concept you have here are just a little short. A little short. Yeah, I think I think I want to elongate the foot. Um, yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna actually try to go back and do that. Is that totally you know, off? Because I, I um. think that I would I would almost like to see them uh, extend. You know, al almost to the large category. I think that some of them might be really big, really big. Yeah, I like that. I, th I actually think that's a better approach because, um, you know, they they do have some luminescence. They might then we they might actually have eyes. I don't know. We haven't really. I haven't. <laughs> that's a, that, you know, it's one of those things where I was like, I that's like not really super high on my to do list to figure out. Do they have eyes? <laughs> uh, it could be a, it could be an ongoing question. That yeah, nobody like, knows. <laughs> do they actually have eyes? I don't know. Um, I think it'd be interesting to see that the, the face mask, although it's it's kind of cosmetically different to each individual, uh, mm -hmm. is fused to their head. Sure. You know, it's, it's kind of this this plate that stands off of their head. I was going somewhere and I lost my train of thought too. Yeah, I got a little I got a little weird all of a sudden for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> it was just suddenly quiet crickets. Uh, what is uh, the, what? What if they're what if they're evil? What if they eat people? What if they eat the flesh of? Uh, well, you know, so that creatures? was actually one of the things that I had considered <laughs> is is when they go hollowed, they develop the need to eat. Uh, so they do grow mouths. They will grow mouths if it's required, but they don't they don't use mouths to communicate. They they could do it telepathy. You know, they they could talk to somebody else's mind. It's part of I that. Wanna, I want like a I want a blood orchid expansion now. Oh, what? Well, sorry, say that again. I want a blood orchid expansion where they just like. They're terrifying. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, and, and it was so like what I was saying with one of their original concepts was that they could take an advantage that would allow them to cannibalize people. Like yeah, a yeah, Venus yeah. flytrap, you know, just like suck it in and devour it. Just give them like sharp teeth here and then we got a bottom jaw down here and then we're good. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. they, I do like the idea of making them more, more centric around the avatars of the forest. You know, they were not in like a, a floofy fairy sort of way, but in a really brutal sense of they will do everything in their power to defend what is theirs. Um, but also like they, they need to have a little bit of that monstrous appearance because they do they do kind of they are they, they may be seen as ambassadors, but they're very much capable creatures. I think and, uh, I think I'm done. Yeah. What, what are your yeah. thoughts here? What do we, what do we got going on here? No, I think that I think that what you've come down to in this particular one is a great example of what I would see as a middle-aged uh, seedless or <laughs> seedless the, the Rowan seedless is not a polite term. You shouldn't call them that. Um, uh, but they they, I think that this is you know they've, this one's showing a little bit more experienced, a little bit more aged in the body with the the more aggressive textures with the hands sure. or just the shape of the hands and the legs um i really i really do like that i think that 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 carries kind of the 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 story of the character a little bit farther um i really enjoy the armaments it looks really nice the the captured what i was talking about in the legs with the the plant matter kind of like an upside down flower yeah. um i would like to see i think more variations of that in in various takes all right. Thanks again for watching, everybody. My name is Nicholas, and thanks again, Alex, for joining us. If you do want to check out Chalice RPG uh, and join the conversation or just check out the system for yourself, you can check that out at patreon.com slash chalice RPG. As always, comments and suggestions down below are great. You can find us on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, uh, really just anywhere where you can type something and go ahead and throw that up on the, on the web, and we'll hopefully try to get back to you. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and we'll catch you next time.